Hello everybody, welcome back to the Nibiru channel. It is September 15th, 2016. Extraordinary story coming out of the Nibiru channel a few minutes ago. One of our Nibiru researchers by the name of Eric gave me a call to schedule our afternoon meeting. He said to me, have you been outside yet? I said a few hours ago. I said, what's up? He said, you better go outside and look up into the sky. Well, that freaked me out a little bit, folks, because I'm thinking I'm going to step out my door and I'm going to look up into the sky and there's going to be Nibiru knocking on my back door. But anyways, what he wanted me to see is the chemtrailing. Out of nowhere, chemtrail planes started crisscrossing the sun and only the sun in very, very straight, organized patterns just like a tic-tac-toe board, they're blocking out the sun. Not only are they spraying awful chemicals into our atmosphere, but they're also trying to hide the evidence that's in the sky. Bottom line, you can't hide it forever. That's going to be absolutely 100% impossible. This is video that I took at that moment. Today's forecast was supposed to be crystal clear skies, sunny, 83 degrees. Well, that doesn't look like it's going to happen today, does it? Because they're blocking out the sun because they don't want us to see Nibiru, Planet X, but guess what? I come prepared. I put the blue filter on. I immediately started videotaping. You can see faintly the chemtrails. And this was just prior to three other planes arriving. I mean, these must be very skilled pilots to fly large planes loaded down with chemicals in such close patterns. I mean, within a matter of 20 minutes, they blocked out the sun completely. I could see nothing but a heavy cloud cover starting to form. I guess it's going to rain. But it usually doesn't rain whenever they chemtrail so heavily. We just get those thick black clouds that do not move in the airstream up above. Folks, we need to come to the realization, like I said earlier, this is happening, it's in our face, what are we going to do about it? Well, there's not much we can do about it other than being prepared, getting our facts straight, knowing what's up there, banding together, and we're going to have to face this. There's no doubt about it. We're going to have to face this. These are going to be some awful days that we are going to experience in this lifetime. I sit and wonder and think about this every day. I wish there was more I could do for my mankind, for all of the people out there walking on this earth. This planet belongs to us. We, the people. This is not a corporate planet. This is not a government planet. This is our planet. We live on Mother Earth. And now, we're going to have to live with the thoughts of what is about to happen. I've got a pretty good idea. I do my research daily. And the outcome doesn't look good. But we have to be prepared. There's absolutely no doubt we have to be prepared. And as far as the little trolls go, yeah, don't feed the trolls. Well, guess what, trolls? You just got served up a big plate of in-your-face. 
I want to thank all of our Nibiru watchers from around the world. You guys are fantastic. You're doing a hell of a job. Keep all of your emails with your photographs and your videos coming in. You can email them to NibiruPlanetX2016 at gmail.com. Don't forget to share our videos with your friends and family members on Facebook. And don't forget to subscribe to the Nibiru channel for all of our updates. And like I say, keep an eye in the sky.